What up, y'all? This is Inside Overseas. We got highlights and hot takes this week, and we ain't wasting no time. Let's get it. We're going to start with Willie Hernan Gomez and Jabari Parker putting in work for Barcelona as they got a win against Red Star. They both took a trip upstairs catching alley-oops in the first half. Willie catching his in pick and roll and Jabari getting busy in transition. Willie had 18 points in this game catching bodies and overall he was dominant around the basket. I expect him to have a big impact for Barcelona this season. Not too many bigs can deal with his strength and skill. Jabari had 20 points pushing the ball coast to coast like he did last week. Said it before and I'll say it again, if you let him off the leash, he could be a serious problem in your league. And Jabari Parker driving, pulling up, shooting. Was he fouled there? No. And they've got five seconds now for Parker. Still Jabari Parker. Y'all know we got to check out the pass her around the world. Darius Thompson found Tyreek Jones on one of the craziest lives I've seen in a minute. I really don't think people understand how hard it is to be attacking a hedge and to throw the lob while you're still engaged in the hedge. I watched this clip like a thousand times and it seems like this lob was premeditated. Tyreek Jones being one of the best athletes in Europe is going to make up for any mistakes, but this was surely, surely a player of the year candidate. And I heard some of y'all talking crazy this year, but Will Clyburn is back and he was getting busy last night. For the life of me, I don't know why Brady Manic is guarding him in some of these plays. I mean, he just gave up on that one. And shout out to Brady for making it to EuroLeague in only his second season, but this is definitely a welcome to EuroLeague game for him. Will got too much sauce for the bigs and he's too big for the smaller defenders. They going straight to the block. Dope to see him cooking again. Once again, we got Chima Maneke. Little known fact, he is currently leading EuroLeague in points per minute. His foot speed is an advantage he's gonna have over every forward in this league. I talked to him a couple weeks ago and I was telling him when he get downhill, he is impossible to guard. Too quick for the bigs, too strong for the littles, he's a problem. Great to see him flourishing this year after averaging only four points last year in Monaco. He's up to 17 this year. Can't wait to see how he finishes the season. But let me know what y'all think. Why y'all think Chima's playing so well this season? Let me know in the comments. That's all we got. Please like, subscribe, and I appreciate all the support. Let's keep it going. I'll catch y'all next time.